The former grounds of the Roblin Steel Mill were the site of an investigation this past weekend when the central New Jersey-based Paranormal Activity Research Society came to check reports of mysterious lights and noises. After examining blueprints of the old Main Gate building, which is now the Roblin Museum, the PARS decided to focus much of their attention on a room that used to house jail cells when the Roblin was a company town and police offices were here. In the late 1930s, a man hanged himself in the cells, and the group wonders if his spirit still lingers. Now, the gallery features images of the family that owned and ran the mill, which closed in 1974 after fabricating the cables that support the Brooklyn and Golden Gate bridges. But given the relatively common occurrence of industrial accidents during the mill's operations, the investigators question whether some victims of those accidents may have left something behind. Using infrared and thermal cameras, as well as audio recorders, they spent Saturday night checking the grounds. Their hypothesis? Entities continue to walk their way through the main gate building and down the cobblestone path to the sprawling mill campus, from which they were never to return.